Hi everyone and welcome back to some more Civilization 6. So, before we declare another war, I'm just going to wait to finish this observation balloon. Because it's only two turns away, might as well finish it first. It will improve our range. Our artillery range. So, other than that, we will be building the spaceport soon, just waiting to finish the power plant in Amsterdam. It's almost done. We are having some amenity issues, but not for long, I don't think so. We can probably buy some luxury. We can check. So let's actually take a look. We can buy olives. And the trade. What does he want? Some gold? I am okay with this. Sure. And another one? Maybe from Cleopatra? No. And Shaka? I already got pearls, so we don't need that one. Okay, I suppose that will do. Minus one. Yeah, it's probably mostly minus one. And only in like three cities. Or two cities even. Okay, yeah, it's fine. Wait, Amsterdam is actually at zero. Is it? Yeah, it's at zero. But it says insufficient amenities? Okay. Sure, whatever. Anyway, let's actually grab a shipyard here. Just in case. Yeah, I might get a few ships over here. In case we end up fighting China. I mean, we probably will eventually. Towards the end of the game. But just in case they decide to backstab us. So, let's keep moving. We got one more turn. And then we can declare war. Right, and we will remove the jungle. Right, that will actually finish the balloon right now. But let's save that boss for whatever is going to be next. As for this builder... Yeah, some more mines. And that will be fine. And here's another trade route. We'll send that to China. Off you go. And we got two more builds. I'm actually thinking another forest might not be a bad idea. Yeah, let's grab a forest and then a lumber mill. Some more production definitely won't hurt. Okay. We are still waiting to get a district right here. But that will require some population growth. We are doing quite well though. Economics is a subject and we got economics. Influence. What's next? Let's see what we need the most. We could grab replaceable parts now. I think that's going to be it. Because we need that anyway. So, replaceable parts, then we'll get advanced ballistics to unlock the machine gun, and then we can get nuclear fission. Or we can get plastics, that's also an option. That way we'll be able to build an offshore oil rig. And we can get quite a few of those. Okay, sure, let's get plastics, why the heck not. And then... Let's see. So I could move a governor here and then straight up pay for an aerodrome. I definitely will, but maybe not yet. Or we could hard build one. Only 13 turns! I thought it would take longer than that. Okay, interesting. However, before we do that, uh, let's chop that jungle. And we can speed something up. What would that be? Yeah, that's a good question. Something cheap, preferably. We don't need a second observation balloon. Cavalry, perhaps. Because we could actually use that. Okay, let's chop that. And I leave it in the queue, but now we can actually build an aerodrome right here. And move it to the front. And now we can chop the other jungle to speed up the aerodrome. Sounds good to me. Alright, let's keep moving. 
And then we'll need an aerodrome near Eindhoven. Might as well queue it up already. Can we actually do it? Yes, we can. Okay, so down here. There it is. Alright, looks good. Lumber meal. And it does that. So, three more builds on this fella. We can still get a mine. No, that's supposed to be for the district. Okay, never mind then. Our artillery is here. Nice. That makes me feel safer, for sure. Alright. Grab that mine. Oh, wait, hold on. Is this from a city state? I think so? No, it's not. Wait, where is this from? I'm a little bit confused. What the heck? I'm still a bit confused where this is from. From a city-state. Consular. Interesting. So that's not the actual suzerain ability. That's just from a city-state. Uh, but which one? Consular. That's a consular city-state. That's not supposed to be unlocked. Okay, this seems like a bug. Because clearly we are not the suzerain here, I only have one envoy. This is not supposed to be unlocked. I mean, it's still tempting. Although, I think I prefer production. Let's check the city real quick. What are we even working? Yeah, well, we could get one of those. Again, it seems like a bug that is even unlocked. But hey, whatever. If it's available, I'll grab it. So that's a pretty nice style now. And we're working it right away. Okay, so... What else? And nothing on this turn. We can still get a polder or two. And we will, don't worry. It's coming. Almost there. There's the observation balloon. And we might as well just declare war. Pretty much, yeah. So let's do it. That's going to be a Golden Age war. Obviously. Let's go. The penalty will be minimal. We don't have to do this, but it's fun, so we'll do it. Now, first we need to get rid of the district. Which shouldn't take too long, I hope. We can also use our battleship fleet. Yeah, one tile further away. And we got one more. Yep, right here. Uh, that one's slightly too far away, actually. Uh, we can go from the south. That works. Here. And let's take a look with the destroyer armada. This might actually take a little bit of time. Yeah, we did... What? 48 damage out of 200. So, 4 turns. It's fine. As for our spy... Let's see... 90% to steal a tech boost. Let's do that then. Works for me. We could use some more tech boosts. Certainly. Let's see what France is going to do. Probably not a whole lot, to be honest. The only problem we might have is that we don't have too many melee units. But I'm not too worried about that. Oh, this guy is still down here. Well, I think he might die. Not that it matters too much. Oh, hey, we even got a promotion for artillery. Plus one range, we will definitely get that. Obviously. We can also use the field cannon army and first upgrade it. We should probably switch to professional army, now that I think about it, because that was a really expensive upgrade. Yeah. Anyway, Belem. We can build a district here. 
Now we could build an entertainment complex. The location won't be nearly as good, but we could do it. Not sure if we really need it here. I'm honestly not convinced. No, I don't think we do. I might, however, get an aerodrome. Just so that we have one roughly in the middle of our empire. Like on this tile, for example. That looks pretty nice. Then we can airlift from here. We can airlift either east towards China or west towards France. I like that idea. As for Amsterdam, that's going to be the spaceport. I would like a broadcast center, but we need a spaceport specifically. Now, which improvement do we remove? I don't think it really matters too much. Probably the farm right here. Yep, I guess that's fine. Here you go. 20 turns. And now we can use our governor title. Yeah. Space initiative. There you go. And he's already in Amsterdam, so that works perfectly. I don't think that affects the actual spaceport. No, but it affects space projects. And we'll be working on those soon enough. Yeah, the spy will still stay here. So, there you go. And we got one more build. So, how about we get another one of the fancy tile improvements? I mean, we can get it, so I don't see why we shouldn't. Even though it's really not supposed to be unlocked. Whatever. So we can put this guy on the fort. Just to make use of that fort. Alright, more units are coming. Including the cavalry. There you go, and now we can chop the jungle. So, let's do some more damage, shall we? Oh no, we already did. Uh, we need to use the battleships. There you go. Yeah, it's going down soon enough. And then we'll attack the city. I could have bypassed it, but it will be easier if we just get rid of it. Certainly. And let's take a look around a little bit. I don't expect to really find anything, but we can take a look around anyway. I'm pretty sure France doesn't have access to things like submarines. I'm 99% sure they don't have submarines. Well, I mean, they might. They are two tanks behind us. But even if they do, that's not going to be a big problem. I don't think so. Especially now that we have plus one range artillery with an observation balloon. The Cold War is not There's going. Cold War. It is burning. So, do we want professional army? I think so. Can we get rid of skyscrapers? We are still building the Sydney Opera House. Yeah, if I get rid of that, this will take longer. I don't think it will take much longer. And I'm not quite willing to get rid of anything else. I like my gold. We could probably dump the Theater Square District bonus. Then again, I kind of need culture to unlock airlift. 8 turns to get rapid deployment. And how many turns to finish the aerodrome? 7 turns. So I'd rather keep that. Yeah, I like the gold, like I said. So, yeah, what do we replace? I have to replace something. Okay, fine, let's replace culture, at least for now. Fine. I'm still going to pick that up later. So, professional army, where the heck is it? Uh, not seeing it. Wait, where the heck is it? Oh yeah, right here. Here, done. Okay, so still 8 turns to get rapid deployment. Okay, yeah, we didn't really lose much culture, so it's fine. Let's grab the polder. And one more fancy improvement. And there's another trade route. Rotterdam. Yeah, just send it to Egypt. 
We could send it from Amsterdam, which at this point might be a slightly better idea. Yeah, we'll get a few more hammers. It might save us one turn. So, remove the jungle. There, that saved us two turns. And let's do some more damage. This is good for experience. Oh yeah, now we can upgrade the units. So, mortar. I still can't upgrade the cavalry, but it's coming, don't worry. And the battleships. Here you go. Yeah, destroying this will probably take longer than actually taking the city itself. But I don't mind. So, fortify and wait for your turn. Yeah, the tiles are a little bit packed. We are using almost all of the available space. And I think we can get out of here. Right, I can't move on this turn anymore. And you saw that city? <laughs> That's a pretty funny city right there. Well, whatever flaws his boat. I guess it's for Amber. But I don't know. It would have been better further to the north. This is just bad. Oh hey, we got a great person. What kind? Great engineer. Plus one appeal to any tiles the city owns. I might actually pass on that. I don't need it. Yeah, I'm going to pass on this guy. We'll get the next one. So, Rotterdam. We just finished the seaport. So now we can get a few more ships or maybe stock exchange. It's only four turns. So let's grab that. Get the polder. And there, done. We could probably still use another builder around here. Oh, nice. Battleship got a promotion and now... France is sending their own battleship. Okay. No problem. I don't think our artillery can reach him. Actually, this one can. Nice. Oh, he's already down! That was quick. Now, which promotion do we want? Let's see. Uh, probably bombardment and a rolling barrage. Yep, sounds good to me. Well, let's do some more damage. Shouldn't take much longer, I don't think so. Here. That's a promotion for the mortar, nice. And stay fortified. And we got yet another promotion. I think suppression will be best here. Yep, definitely. I can't move from here, I'm afraid. So. One more AT gun is coming. He can merge with this guy. That's the general idea. And this one... Oh yeah, right. That was supposed to stay on top of the fort. There's the trade route from Amsterdam. Doesn't really matter where we send it. It kind of does. Plus five hammers. Okay, that one looks good. Let's go here. Might as well kill that archer and get the heck out of here. We should be able to get out of there. I think so. And we should probably go back and upgrade them to rangers. Yeah, that sounds reasonable. Let's do that. They have quite a bit of experience, especially some of them. Oh, they actually have tanks. I'm almost impressed. Almost. Did he just try to attack us with Warrior? Yeah. Plus one error score. I might actually lose that Explorer. I can upgrade here, but I don't want to. Let's just run away. Next research. Computers. Actually, no. Replaceable parts. We kind of need that by now. I'd say so. And Eindhoven. We'll grab a hangar. Obviously. And Leiden. Maybe we should get an encampment. You know, just in case. We could get one here. 
that would be a nice spot for an encampment, actually. It will be in range of Shanghai. I like that. I think I'll grab one here. Okay, yeah, let's grab one. It definitely won't hurt. Get the heck out of here. We got two more builds. We can still get a polder. Uh, actually, I think he still had the movement point left. Yep. So, we might want to back up. 60 health. But now there's a tank. Might be better to back up. Huh. Yeah, perhaps. How much damage can we do here? We can almost destroy it. The next turn should be enough. Here. Fortification is at zero. Which means it can't bombard us anymore. Okay, yeah, that's fine. You're still coming? I just want to merge these. So all we need to do is disembark, like so, and then merge them into an army. That's the general idea. As for our spy, we got a few options. We can sabotage production. We can try to steal a tech boost. We can neutralize governor. I think I'll sabotage production. Sounds good, 84%. And we can still attack. Here. This is good experience. But that's it. Okay, next. And we got synthetic materials boost. Nice. So now, disembark and merge into an army. There we go, nice. Alright then. We just need to pillage this. So that's as much damage as I can do. Yep, can't do any more damage. Now I need the tank to leave the district, basically. But we could start attacking the city. Oh, hi. Where do you think you're going? A tank army, eh? Would be a shame if something happened to it. Let's finish it off with the destroyer. Might as well, and there it goes. Nice. So, anything else we can attack around here? Let's take a look. Uh, yeah, we got artillery. Let's attack it then. From here. 68 damage. And what's going on in Balem? Yeah, let's grab a hangar. We'll be able to use airlift in five turns. Since we can't airlift without rapid deployment. So that's that. Yeah, I need that tank to leave the district. Where do we send the trader out? Egypt. It doesn't really matter which one exactly. Actually, maybe we should send it to China instead. We are making 313 gold per turn. Oh, screw it. Egypt is fine. Any more polders? Yes. Right here. We yeah, are looking good. Just heal back to full. And yeah, let's stay here. No, let's move a little bit more because the barbarians are still a little bit too close for my taste. This should actually be quite fun. France actually has relevant units. I'm almost impressed. Almost. So I need that tank to move. Yeah, he did. Good. Okay. Many of us take better care and of now we unlocked bodies. infantry. Nice. Now I can upgrade a lot of outdated units. Like the really old unique unit. Here, we're inside the district. And now we can keep moving forward. So let's do exactly that. Come on, people. Yeah, this is a little bit crowded. It will have to do. The cavalry can stay inside the city for now. And let's maybe get rid of that tank. That would be good. Here, we can 
finish it off with artillery. I mean, with a battleship. Done. And we can pillage some tiles. We'll regain the health. Okay, looks good. As for research. I'm thinking, yeah, advanced ballistics. Okay, sure, advanced ballistics. Broadcast center. And then probably stock exchange. Oh wait, we still need the power plant in here, really? Okay. And we can also get food market, which we probably should. But first, let's get the power plant. And the next stop... Uh, hold on a moment, maybe we should build an entertainment complex here. One, two, three, four... Yeah, we could build one here. I think I'm going to do that. It won't take long, so let's just grab it, it's fine. Still can't get a district. We need, yeah, 13 population. We are currently at 10. This will take a little bit too long, I think. But oh well. Okay, shipyard is fine. And that's it. Yeah, let's go back into our territory to upgrade. Or we can use Egypt. Back up a bit more. And I guess we'll need some builders to improve the oil. Especially oil we can actually work. As in oil in range of our actual cities. A trade for a luxury, yes. Oh, we she wanted to sneak in the great work. I don't think so. Okay, what does she want for this? Yeah, she would accept this. Will she give us some gold? No. Well, a few gold pieces. That's such a waste of time. She will give us literally one gold. Hey, sure, whatever. Works for me. Thanks for the one gold. I'll try to not spend it all in one place. There's the aerodrome. So now we need rapid deployment. So. How's his health? 45 health. He should be okay? I think he will be okay. Alright, let's focus on the city next. How long will it take? It might actually take a little bit of time. Yeah, it will take some time. Uh, hold on, what's the range? Uh, we need to be one tile closer, I think. We can move forward and then pillage. We can also back up. Yeah, here's the problem with backing up. I can embark, but only through here. Alright, let's just move one tile forward. I think we'll be okay. Famous last words. Okay, onwards. And embark with the mortar. Here, we can actually attack. There. Minus 18 defenses. That will do. I'm pretty sure he will be fine, but I guess we'll find out on the next turn. Carthage. Food market. Yeah, let's actually grab a food market here. Make it grow a little bit faster. That's a trade route. So, same as before, roughly. Uh, that's slightly better. Kind of. Well, plus six hammers. I prefer that. Back you go. And you need to heal up, I guess. Any more units? Yeah, upgrade. Right, hold on. Let's just upgrade everything. 710 gold. Yeah, we can also get spec ops. So let's do that. Yeah, let's just go through all these units and upgrade everything. And also, we can bring our great general through the aerodrome. Just need to wait for rapid deployment, but we can move him into position. Uh, more upgrades. Yeah, we got quite a few units all over the place. This guy. This will cost us quite a bit of money, but I mean, we had over 10,000. We can afford it. Some of these upgrades are pretty expensive. Is that it? 
Pretty sure we still have more, or do we? Uh, let's check the list. So, do we have more? Oh yeah, we can upgrade the battering ram. I'm just looking for actual units. Yeah, this fella. So, there you go. And anything else? I think that's it. I can't upgrade the cavalry yet. Let's upgrade the battering ram. It's not like we'll need the battering ram anymore. Most certainly not. Oh, he's actually attached right. Remove that. I can't move him anymore. But we can upgrade him to a supply convoy. That's going to be far more useful. And yeah... Not sure if that was such a good idea. I think I can embark and then protect him with the battleship. And our spy failed, apparently. Okay. Well, that's disappointing, because that was like 90%, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I actually can't embark right now. 26 health. Might be better to back up at this point. Yeah, I think we should back up. Hold on. Let's use the battleships first. To bombard the city. Uh, we got a promotion. I will pick that up. To not waste experience. Alright, yeah, we need to back up, so... Let's do it like this. Here. That should be fine. Okay. I can't do much with that mortar, I'm afraid. I could disembark on this side, but that's not exactly safe. I would rather not do that. Rotterdam. We don't need an aerodrome here. Let's grab a food market. It has 16 out of 25 housing, so plenty of room for growth. There's the other spy. 90% to steal a tech boost. I want to do that. Let's do it. Okay, are we done? Oh yeah, and we can also merge the spec ops, especially the inexperienced ones. This guy. And there's the trader. Yeah, plus six production. Okay, next. We should be taking the city pretty soon, but we'll need a few more turns at least. It will go faster once we get some bombers. And we will get some bombers. Oh nice, we got a great person. That's going to be a great merchant. Increases trade route capacity by 1, plus 25% tourism rate towards other civilizations you have a trade route to. I mean, that's not amazing. But we could grab him. It's an atomic era grid merchant. So it's not like there are many more coming. Still, I could pass. If I want to. Who's most likely to get him? Oh yeah. Lautaro. I think I'll let him. This doesn't do enough for us. So, okay, let's just pass. The next one. Industrial zone districts provide plus 10 tourism. Yeah, okay, that's not really better to be honest, but... Fine! A barracks or stable? Probably barracks. Yep, definitely barracks. And receiver. Just grab that food market. So, uh, we need to back up a little bit. So, swap it with the artillery army. Or with this one. Okay, let's swap with this one. Because this guy has plus one range. So, he will be in range regardless. And the other one does not have plus one range. 
just need to move the battering ram into our territory. Okay, let's finish off the artillery first. Like so, and then we can take a shot at the city. There, it's already down to like half, slightly more than half fortification. And we'll be getting rapid deployment on the next turn. That way we can airlift our general. And the spec ops and any more units we want. The problem is that there's not a whole lot of space. But I might airlift some melee unit. Yeah, like the infantry army, we should definitely do that. Sounds good. Upgrade. Now, this guy is experienced, so I don't think I'll be merging him with other experienced units. We can recruit some more spec ops and then merge. Wait, what? China declared their friendship with France. Okay. Well, I have no intention of doing that. We got advanced ballistics, so that unlocks the machine gun. Never mind the maneuvers. And we got rapid deployment. And our alliance expired. Alright then, let's renew that. That was economic. We still want that, I would say. Yep, definitely. Can't go wrong with more gold, especially when we can buy districts. And our next research... Yeah, I'm thinking nuclear fission. And then we'll build the Manhattan Project. Or we could go for guidance systems to get the rocket launcher. There's no way we'll be killing a fighter because, well, I don't think anyone will get a fighter anytime soon other than us. So let's unlock the rocket launcher. You can't go wrong with rocket launchers, obviously. And there's the supply convoy. You can stay here, that's out of range. Okay, sounds good. A tank army. Alright. Let's airlift, shall we? Yes, let's. We will definitely need that infantry army. So, don't worry, it's coming. Uh, wait, can we not airlift yet? We did complete rapid deployment. Oh wait, it needs to contain airport. Right. I forgot about that part. And we're still working on the hangar. Okay, I guess it will have to wait a little bit longer. What's our next civic research going to be? Well, we could go for space race. That makes sense. That definitely makes sense. Okay, let's do that then. That's 13 turns. We have no need to change policies right now. A food market? Uh, wait, no. That's one of the few cities that's not super high on housing. Uh, how about we start getting some air units? That sounds reasonable. We will need some biplanes for a boost. Yeah, for advanced flight. So how about we do that? Maybe before the power plant? Yeah, let's get some before the power plant. I'd like that boost. And what's going on in Leiden? Grab an armory after that. And Rio. Yeah, research lab, I guess. Uh, hold on. How about some ships? You know, again, just in case. I definitely wouldn't mind that. Let's grab a submarine. That might come in handy. Yeah, shipyard is fine. And, oh, right, that's the trade route from our capital to Beijing. There's the spec ops. We can just send them the hard way, to be honest. And that's going to be faster. Yeah, we'll just send the infantry, like, normally, the hard way. Also, the Sydney Opera House will be done in two turns. Then we can switch to naval units or something. That's probably what I'll do. And we are going to need advanced flight for the airport. Then we can use airlift. You know what? It's only six turns to research that. I don't actually think it's worth waiting for that boost. Yeah, let's just straight up research that. And rocket artillery can wait, because I'd like to be able to airlift. And we need the airport for that. We can just buy the airport as soon as we finish advanced flight. 
That's probably what I'll do. However, that's going to be the end of this episode, so thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, leave a like if you did, or a dislike if you didn't, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.